Lisa, members and supporters of the LGBTQ plus community took to the streets to protest House Bill 1557 and show their support for Transgender Day of Visibility. Our ABC Action News reporter Lydia Vasquez joins us live from Curtis Hickson Park. Lydia, what are they hoping and what were they hoping rather to accomplish today? Well, Vanessa, a few dozen people here in downtown Tampa could be heard chanting, we say gay and trans lives matter, as they rallied against House Bill 1557, dubbed by critics as the Don't Say Gay Bill. Now, that bill was passed and signed by Governor Ron DeSantis last week, and today, rally goers tell me they want him and everyone in support of the law out of office. Florida House Representative Michelle Rayner Goolsby kicked off the rally. She's the first openly queer black woman elected to the Florida legislature. She tells me she hopes this event will encourage people to be in intentional about who they elect in office. What I'm really hoping is that people take away one, that we can no longer have discrimination against anybody here in our state and in our country. But number two, they take that energy, they take that, you know, them being upset to the ballot box. Representative Rainer Goolsby told the crowd, quote, gay folks have been here and we're not going anywhere. Now I ask students and those attending this rally what they hope to accomplish. They tell me they just hope that people get to the ballot and vote. Coming up tonight at 11, we're going to go in depth about some of the concerns this bill could have in the classroom now that a lawsuit has been filed in federal court. Reporting live in downtown Tampa, Lydia Vasquez, ABC Action News.